Hey everybody, run this 342 year old Warframe gameplay. And I'm going to address the big elephant in the room here, which is basically a part of the previous video I made. If you stuck around to the end, you probably noticed that I had a little giveaway going on. If you did, stick to the end. Um, and now the winner of that giveaway is Eugene, or e Eugenio, however you pronounce your name. I am messaging you on... Hmm, I would say, I would like to say um, YouTube, but I'm not sure if that's a good place to message you. Um, but if you're watching this video, please uh, send me a message on Twitter so I can uh, gain, a uh, well, gain, but obtain your information so I could provide it to DE so they can provide you with your prize of, of a, you know, of your choice, either a Nyx Prime or pack or an, a Rhino Prime pack. Uh, so it's your choice. Um, but that's that. That was the winner. I have three screenshots. Just go on the random.org. Since we only had two contestants, it was more of a heads or tails type of thing. But I did it three times, and it's time stamped. Um, and I can provide that if need be. However, the winner has been just mentioned. So do please message me on Twitter so you can claim your prize. If you don't claim your prize in a week, uh, it will automatically default to the second place winner, which is Kotel. So that's that. So let's talk about Melee 3.0, which was mentioned in the dev stream. Um, that was one of the biggest highlights in the dev stream. We did see a new tile set, and we did see how they are adding more uh, movement and better textures to the game. We also saw a little bit, a bits and pieces of the uh, the new frame Revenant and how he works, and that and how and that he's coming soon, as well as Frame Fighter, which is coming soon. But the Melee 3.0 was one of the biggest things that was in the dev stream. Um, they made it so that it they it feels to me like they simplified it, which for me I, I really appreciate that because now instead of trying to push all these random buttons to do your combos, now there I believe there are like three ways you either block you have to block and then you can do your attack. You could go in the air and do a a uh, targeted slam. So a uh, What's the term? Uh, when you just go up, go up in the air and you go to slam down with your weapon, you could target where you want to slam, which is really cool. I really like that. That was what got me interested in Melee 3.0, basically. And um, just how your stances work will do different types of movements. It make, it, they really made it feel, in my personal opinion, how Warframe is played in the trailers. How the frames do all their crazy moves. That's what it looked like to me, and that is really cool. I really am looking forward to Melee 3.0, um, but I really want to know your thoughts about it. Um, there are different. There, the the Melee 3.0 is going to be for all melee weapons, of course. And one of the cool features that they showed was you being able to use a glaive and a pistol at the same time, which that's already in effect. However, just the way that you can do your combos with the two is was pretty neat. So I'm really looking forward to that kind of stuff. But what are your thoughts about Melee 3.0? What do you think they could do to improve it before it's released? What are your thoughts? I'm very curious to know. Um, and we could probably start a pretty good discussion with this. But that's it for now. It's a short video, but I wanted to really announce the winner of the Unvaulted Prime Access Pack, as well as just your thoughts on the dev stream with Melee 3.0 coming out soon, hopefully. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'm Run the Street Part 2, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. Take care.